five things that I've learned from shooting weddings. Number one is use a tripod. Yes, you might be using a lightweight Lumix camera. Even so, even with the amazing in-body stabilization, when you're doing half an hour, hour long speeches and you're standing there going like this, your arms will get tired. But it wasn't plenty of fish. Number two is if you are shooting a cinematic sequence, shoot it in a slower frame rate so you have the ability to slow it down. I shot a cinematic sequence and I shot it at 25. And don't get me wrong, it's very nice. It's, it's a nice piece. However, if I could have slowed it down, it would have just been creme de la creme. Number three is I need to invest in a bigger hard drive because the one terabyte in my MacBook Pro clearly doesn't cut it for my projects that are nearly a terabyte. And at number four is I need to invest in an on-camera shotgun microphone. So I was shooting the bride opening presents and the bridesmaids opening presents and I didn't even think about micing them up. I was just like, let's get the shot. I didn't think to lab them up or anything. So I used the camera's onboard microphone and you can just hear me breathing in the background and it's fucking awful. And number five is that having a second body so you can have two different sort of like focal lengths or whatever would be really, really helpful. So that's why I bought this thing. Another one. Look at twins. And that was my list of five things that I've learned from shooting weddings.